Hi, Grandma Mary here, and man, am I peeved. I'm telling you, Facebook is doing it again. They're messing with things, and it has to do with pages. You may have noticed, if you're a page owner, that your some of your page posts aren't showing up in the news feed, and that's what irritates me. They're only showing up in this ticker area, and so your, your people who like you are missing it if they're not sitting here watching the ticker all day. So, you know, that's just annoying because they've liked you and they're not getting your news. What can you do? Lots of good things to do here. We have to try and work around these things that Facebook puts out. And so first thing is try and make sure you're getting interaction because if, if people are interacting with you, you're more likely to show up in that news feed. Now that's not always the case. We've done some testing, even if people are liking and commenting, sometimes it still doesn't happen. What else can you do? You can educate your people to watch for your posts, and that sometimes happens because you might get people saying, hey, you're not in my news feed anymore, where are you, I miss you, even though you've been posting and working your little buns off trying to get some interaction. So you, you train people to watch for your posts by doing fun little things and, and having a, a Thursday swap meet, link meet or something like that or a fan of the week or whatnot. But you can also educate people on how to make a list that includes your page so that they can always click on that list to make sure they don't miss anything. So here's what you do. You tell them, hey, Go create a list, and actually you could just link to this little tutorial so they know uh, how to find you. So tell them to create a list by going over to their lists area here, down here, and you may have to click the more if it's not here. Sometimes it, this little list area is here, sometimes it's not. Click more to even find the list. Here's all the lists you have that you've created. Now there's some that Facebook creates for you, close friends, I don't know, they pick your own close friends. but you want to tell them to create a list like this and name it my favorite favorite pages or or tech pages or something like that um, so that they know uh, that they want to keep track of this list now when they go into the this list um, it, they have to add your page to this list so then they'll get the updates whenever they click on this favorite play, pages area so you could, you could tell them to do it the hard way. This is by adding pages in there, like maybe I'll add in Social Media Examiner, and of course we're going to add in little Grandma Mary right there. So you just click on it to add it, and then boom, it starts populating with the latest posts. Now, uh, maybe I'll add in TechCrunch or something like that. I like TechCrunch, sure. So you, that way you have to kind of know the t title of the page. Now an easier way to create this list is to see all the pages that you've liked by going up to this manage list drop down here and say add remove friends. Now instead of having, now friends it's nice to add, you know, you can make friends lists and all this kind of thing, but here you want to change this to pages. Now I'm, I can easily go through all the pages I've liked, man I've liked a lot of pages, wow. I'm a good liker, huh? Um, so, you know, maybe I'm going to put in there Cancun, and maybe I'm going to put in uh, the mayor real estate, and all kinds of whatnot. But you can just kind of scroll through or search here, and it makes it easy for you to just click, 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 and then boom, you've got your list of your favorite pages. Big brands, yeah, got to do big brands. Yep, good stuff there. So I'm, I'm going to make some lists here. That's the easiest way to do it is just go into that manage list drop down and boom, done, you're done. You got your, every time you click on this favorite list area, you can then see all your favorite lists. You can even edit this to make it a favorite so it's always on the side. Now you'll just always have it there so you can have, where did my favorites go? It's up here. It's behind my head. Favorite pages right there. So it's always there under my favorites and I can easily click on it. So, you know, there's some good options. Educate your people on how to make sure they're watching for your posts and, and uh, hopefully that helps and we'll, until Facebook changes something next time, who knows? All right.
Talk to you later.